right so this is a very quick tutorial on how to solve the common problem so i was facing this issue oh, let me paste it here about uh, docker not restart uh, docker desktop is starting so whenever i started it i installed it and i started it this is what i kept seeing this was happening for past couple of days so i installed docker two days ago and this is what is continuously happening so i'm running windows 10 okay i'm not running windows 11 as you might already have guessed i'm running windows 10 and this is what is happening so it's very easy to uh, solve and what i did is firstly you have to quit a docker desktop now if you see i think um it's already running for me so if you see docker is running uh, the way to verify it is if you right click here docker desktop is running so let's solve the problem and it is very simple to solve what you have to do is i have actually kept the commands as it is so firstly try to fire the wsl hyphen l hyphen v command okay so this is the first command you need to fire and here you'll see ubuntu stopped and one so here what what this says is uh, windows subsystem for linux is stopped or not running okay now after that you need to do simple firstly you have to quit docker desktop okay and after that you have to fire this wsl double hyphen update command once you do that it will start installing or rather updating the windows subsystem for linux so once that is done uh, it will take around one minute or so and do wsl double hyphen version so this is the output of the wsl version after this and then the last command which you need to fire is wsl set default version to 2 set the windows subsystem for linux version to 2 once that is done fire the same command wsl hyphen l hyphen v and now if you see this output and if you see this output it's considerably different you see two more subsystems running okay now that brings a uh, docker desktop up and running also just do one more thing if you go to windows r or the uh or do you say run command just type the run command and do this optional features.exe once you click ok you have to scroll down and you have to make sure virtual machine platform and 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 windows subsystem for linux this is checked okay you have to make sure this uh, virtual machine and windows subsystem for linux so these two should be checked once you do that just restart your docker desktop and it should 100 percent be up and running so if you see it's already up and running it is a quick tutorial on how to solve the docker not starting on your windows machines and this works for windows 10 and windows 11 both